Today we're testing out some of our hard enduro tires. Uh, we've made some additions to our current lineup in terms of compound, construction, and we really want to see if we can improve the performance to get some better, better performance for our athletes and the average consumer. Right now we have a production compound that's pretty soft and uh, we were kind of trying to find a compound that was similar in the softness, like it was still soft, but we wanted it to be able to kind of rebound a little differently. When you grab the knob, it springs back pretty fast with the current one. We wanted to spring back just a little bit slower so we can kind of grip those rocks and really get up those hills and all that kind of stuff and give us an advantage in those sections. So the differences in our in our gnarly is mainly is gonna be the knob height because to be FIM compliant, you gotta be under a certain length. So the gnarly is gonna have much shorter knobs but it's also a 140 size, so it's gonna have a much larger footprint. So you're gonna have more tire on the ground compared to the but the is gonna have taller knobs, so it can dig a little bit deeper in that dirt. So it's kind of pick and choose where you want to uh, have the advantage in. You know, you want that bigger footprint or you want it, want it to dig a little bit deeper in the mud. It's just kind of preference or what kind of track you're at for which one would do better. You're gonna have a bigger footprint on the ground. And it's mainly our production tire right now, so we're going to see if our improvements did better or, or maybe even worse. But this is going to give us a good idea of where we're, what direction we're going in.